Welcome back. It seems like just yesterday the Valley Tigers were hoisting their first ever girls basketball title. That was 2017. Here we are two years later. The Tigers back in the 5A title game. Across from them, a gritty Southeast Polk team that beat them twice this season. Zoe Young and the Tigers searching for another 5A title. They'd have to get past Southeast Polk. Shea Fuller is the big reason why the Tigers are even in the championship. She came up clutch in the semis and clutch again tonight. Here she is getting it going from beyond the arc. One three-pointer. That was followed by another to give Valley an early lead. But back comes Maggie McGraw. The Iowa State commit keeping her Rams in it. She's going to bury the triple here. Southeast Polk down just two. Jump ahead. Two minutes to play now. Southeast Polk still down by two. Liza Sutton. Puts the Rams ahead with a three-pointer here, but here comes the rebuttal. Shea Fuller again coming up in the clutch for the Tigers. Gives Valley a two-point lead. About a minute remaining now. Tie game. Maggie McGraw is fouled. She connects at the line, so the Rams go up two. Guess who answers, though? Zoe Young going to work. The Maryland commit drives. First shot's off. Grabs her own rebound. Puts it in and draws the and one. That's how Valley goes up one. And they hold off Southeast Polk. 65-60 to 60 the final. Young is named the Class 5A All-Tournament Team Captain. She had 23 points. Shea Fuller with 22 for the Tigers tonight. And they are your Class 5A champions. It's bittersweet. Uh, last time playing in a Tiger jersey. Um, obviously lucky. Only one team in 5A can say that they, you know, into their season on a win and I ended my career on a win so there's nothing better than that and it's just an amazing feeling. It feels so good. I mean it doesn't even compare. I mean first getting a state championship first time felt unreal but I never knew I'd feel like this getting the second one. Zoe took this program to a whole new level. Um, she's a two-time state champion now and she just she wasn't gonna let us lose and Shea Fuller knocked down big shot after big shot on one leg um, she's been hurting all year and she just she couldn't wait for this moment and she didn't let it go by. 